Okay, it's been 11 years, and we all want to know. What's up with Skate? Oof. Hey champs, today we'll be looking at Skate. The trailer suggests that the actual name of the game will now be Skate 4. Aww. There's a lot of detail in this one minute video. So let's take a look at the obvious and the not so obvious. There's definitely room for speculation. So I got you guys. So we haven't heard anything from EA for about a year and now they hit us with this bad boy. Alright, so we got some good old motion capture, of course. So this just reminds me of the Tony Hawk games. I remember they were working on this. I'm sure a lot of video games nowadays use this to really capture the body movements. Everything should look pretty solid, so that's exciting. The truth is, it's early. The dude did a Honestly, just the skate franchise has really good bells. They're pretty fun. So that'd be tight if you guys could work on the bells too. Skater XL looks kind of weird. Session, uh, I don't know, you get wrecked. But that'd be really tight if you guys do focus on the bells. The truth is, it's early. We're still working on it. You're joking. You're not joking. But this clip right here just kind of suggests that you could, in fact, break your board. Just imagine like wear and tear or something like that. Or if you're just angry. If you've actually been trying the trick for a minute and you're just over it, that'd be hilarious. All right, let's just continue the video. Has anyone seen gameplay? No, well, a couple people have seen it. What? My boy Cuz over here. There is, in fact, 18 people that were able to see the gameplay, at least on the trailer. Lucky. It was pretty awesome. So right here we have Milky, we have Zexy Zek, of course, Garrett Jenner, Skate 3 Tommy, Atiba. If you guys don't know who those people are, definitely check them out. They're pretty cool. The fact that they're in on this sounds freaking amazing. So let's just keep going. In this case, you could actually see gameplay in Aaron's mirror. If you guys really do want to zoom in, go for it. If you guys have those capabilities, do so. You could probably check out the game maybe a second or two. About time. Got a Tiva, yes. Have this chick named Rico. I actually don't know who she is, but I like her hair color. It looks pretty cool. It just looks beautiful. It does look beautiful. This whole open online. world. Open world. Open world skate? Yo, that would be insane. Seems like that up the board. So that reminds me of skate 2. Reminds me of skate 2. That'd be pretty tight. Bro, Skate 2 is freaking amazing. I'm surprised it's not backwards compatible yet. I don't know what the heck Xbox is doing on that case. Please make Skate 2 backwards compatible. That would be awesome. All right, so then we have... Ooh, you're listening to the fans. Ooh, you're listening to the fans. Straight this to Skater XL. Easy Day Studios, they're coming for you. I'm pretty excited about this. <laughs> there was a lot more that was into that. You guys could check that out on your own time. And those, the board pops and the throwdown. Yeah. I guess just like the animation is going to be pretty cool. So I'm excited for that. It's not going to look too crazy. The no comply was not. Yeah. Zaxi Zek, he is most famous for his Skate 3 content. So that's pretty awesome that they have him just trying this out. Once again, just giving the input, giving his thoughts, his recommendations. I think that's a pretty cool team to have. <laughs> you can climb. You can climb on Skate. That is tight. Perhaps you could just get up onto buildings and jump off and create your own spots. That would be crazy. Playing with all the homies will be so sick. Multiplayer, playing with all the homies? Dang, that'd be super cool. I think that's what any game needs. You just want to play with the homies, you know? That'd be freaking awesome. Explain that spinning rail. Can you do that to anything? Like this is Skate 3 Tommy. He's talking about the rails just spinning, right? So basically, he's well known for his trick shots in Skate. Basically, he's asking, hey man, would you be able to tweak the rails and would you be able to do crazier things? This just kind of opens possibilities for moving different ramps, moving different objects, and just creating your own unique obstacle, which would be pretty awesome. We have Noah here. I don't want to look like anybody else. I don't want to look like anybody else. And then it goes on to this little collage of faces. You guys are in the future. You guys are in the future. Which, honestly, does this just suggest that you would be able to take a photo of your face and upload it to the game, then tweak it and make it look however you want it to look? That would be super crazy. Especially now, Skate 3 was released 11 years ago. Just imagine how much technology has advanced from then 
Who knows? Wait, the game is? The game's what? The game is free. Imagine that. Imagine skate is free. Open world. Wow. That's interesting. So right here you can just see Atiba. He's super freaking excited about this. He's just like, what the heck, right? We have Eiko on the right hand side. He's like, I ain't feeling that. So is the game free? And if it is, it would have microtransactions in the game. Essentially, it would be like Fortnite. The game is free, but you could basically purchase skins, you could purchase emotes, you could purchase characters, etc. Would this mess with the gameplay at all? Perhaps not. It would just make it look a lot cooler. But, once again, a lot of people are definitely against microtransactions. I'm sure you could spend a lot more on the store for things that other people just don't have. And they could definitely collect a lot of revenue in this case. Sting. Really? I don't know. I don't know how to feel about that. We have Cuz over here. Our big thing is don't f it up. Do not F it up. Bro, 11 years plus that we just haven't had a new skate game. You guys better not mess this up. Definitely do take your time. You're not gonna show us anything. Dude, why are you asking me? So we're just so we're just gonna end here? That's that's it? Oh, this is such a tease. Yeah, it really is. Anyways guys, if you guys have not checked out the trailer, definitely do check it out. I'll leave it in the description below. And definitely do come back to this video. And then you guys can let me know what do you guys think. What should EA add to this game? I know they did mention that they are listening to the audience, to the people, to us, which I think is super cool. So once again, what do you guys think that would make this game really awesome? Definitely do leave your comment below. I'll definitely respond to it. I definitely do want to know what's on your mind. So if you guys haven't already, make sure you guys smash that like button. Make sure you turn on those notification bells. Subscribe if you haven't already. I really do appreciate the love from you guys. Peace.